Hey you guys, what's going on? Um, I'm actually about to play a shitload of Destiny, and I was thinking the other day about why people talk shit about so much. What is this? Is that my iPad? Oh, damn. Probably move that. Alright, so why people talk so much shit about other games other people like. I'm going to step back a little bit so you can see my face. So... <laughs> Just took my wife to work a little, uh, heart's going. Um, so I want to talk, like, as you can see from the title, what makes a game good? My own opinion, obviously, but, um, I can give you an example. Um, see, what I like in games is character customization. A character customization can go like, uh, you want to create a character that you want, you want to look like in real life, or you do look like in real life. You you want to be some hot bitch and get free stuff, you know, like RuneScape, because that's what people do. And that shit, I did that too. Not proud of it. Did some things. <sighs> Anyways, um, but people, you know, people make people like looking different from other people. You don't want to be like the same looking person. It, there's no there's no reward to that. There's nothing. I'm gonna back up a little bit so you can see me. Um, now um a good story. Um, as everybody knows, Skyrim, one of the greatest games I've ever played, and there's so much, so much content in it that, you know, it just keeps you going and going and going and going, and then you're like, oh, you know what, I'm going to make another character, and the story isn't boring, like, the story never gets boring. Now, I've heard The Witcher 3 is really good as well, um, I've heard nothing but good things from that game. Um, Everybody likes a good story. Um, now, for some people, it's all about end game. Um, once you beat the game, what is there to do? Um, see, now I'm off and on with Destiny all the time because Destiny likes to take things away from people that you know they worked hard for. Hard for the. Does my hair look stupid? It's fucking hot. I keep my hat off. Um, some people like working hard for things and then having it taken away kind of upsets them. That's why I quit Destiny because my Yellowhorn, my Gallowhorn, Yellowhorn, fucking don't know what it's called, don't even care because I got it and I don't use it. Um, it is a good gun, but it is not what makes the game good. Now, I've been playing a lot more and a like, I mean a lot more. Like, all my time is spent playing this game. I don't put everything up on YouTube because I'm actually... It's what I call research, okay? You know how some people study for tests? Some people, they, uh... They look up things uh, via the internet. Well, I play games to understand them. Um... I'm still using Destiny as an example, but, um... The story? Love the story. And end game? There's <laughs> just... The whole game is endgame. Like, there's nothing but endgame to do. Now, I have a feeling that they will... They'll be re releasing a lot more of the downloadable content as the, the year comes along. But um, they will end up stopping and switching to another game. Now, I've heard whispers. Um, what I mean by whispers is I've looked up online and I've watched a lot of YouTube videos. They're all saying the same thing. That um, there's Destiny 2 coming out. So now a second game makes another game good. Because franchises are always good. Sequels are always good. Um, you'll be able to transfer your character over. That's what I'm getting at. So all your hard work is not being dumped on. But anyways, that's not that's not what I'm talking about. I'm getting a lot into Destiny right now. Because I'm about to play it for like 8 hours straight. Before, after I buy a bag of pistachios. Because I'm craving them pistachios. Um... And a lot of people like lore. Now, for the kids who watch the video, lore is um, backstories, um, history, all that kind of stuff on this game, people in the game, like uh, Dark Souls, great lore in Dark Souls. Um, Destiny, there's a lot of lore in Destiny. Um, Elder Scrolls, th this is all stuff that's not physically in the game. I mean, it can be physically in the game, whether it be just a line said or... A name mentioned, but lore is very, very important to make making a game good. Um, 
these kind of games need to be thrown out there. Like, uh, people need to understand, like, okay, I'm gonna, okay, I'm gonna give you an example of a good game. Elder Scrolls Online. Now, before people start bitching, hear me out. I know Elder Scrolls Online has... It's, it's a little different than Skyrim, but it's not supposed to be Skyrim. Duh. It's supposed to be its own thing. Um, now, of course, they had to mess a few things up in the, uh, the timeline in order to give you guys what you want. But they have done it in a very good way. Now, as they release content, they give you more things to do, but it has never touched multiplayer. Now, multiplayer in Elder Scrolls Online is fucking fantastic. Giant open world, and it just it just feels so good. Like, it's not like a small map where you shoot, you shoot and you're dead, right? You gotta hide behind things, you gotta evade, and, and it's... Even going in there with a group of friends, just killing some random mobs, is is fun as shit. There's lots to do in it. Lots of repeatable uh, quests, there's lots of repeatable everything, and there's, like, you can just keep making money until the next content comes out. Lots of people do that, and it's fantastic. Example of a bad game. I'm going to bash one of my own favorite games, but you guys will understand when I mention the name. Bethesda, you done fucked up. When you made Brink. I, I got that game on release. I was like, oh, Brink, character creation, blah, blah, blah. There's hardly any character creation in it. You leveled up to level 20, and then that's it. And then everything is just the same shit over and over and over and over and over again. Uh, like, it's it. There's no story to it. There's no nothing. Fucking <coughs> nothing. What I like to do when I when I go and get a game, I look up a shitload of videos on the on the on the game itself. I looked up a lot of Dark Souls three. I bought the game because I know it's a good game. I haven't played it. I mean, I played it obviously in my one video, but I know it's a good game. I have something to go to when I'm finished. My fucking this gave it. This is me right here. This is Destiny. Done fucking me hard, man. In a good way. Give me what I want. Give me my fix. Anyways, lips were dry. That's why I licked them. Fucking hurt my wrist, man. I'm stronger than I think. Ugh. But, I keep good games around because good games, good games are good. You people need some good games in your life. Division? Mm, you're on the fence, bitch. You're on the fucking fence. And this ain't a good fence. And a fucking electrical fence with pokey things at the end of it. <sighs> there's no story to it. Like, there's hardly a story. Multiplayer is, is wonderful. It's different. It's different. I, I like how they did the multiplayer in that. I just don't find it too fun. I mean, you beat the game, you level up, and then... That's it. That's it. That's, that's all there is. I mean... They change it from getting a high-end piece of gear and being all excited or making a high-end piece of gear and being like, yeah, I made this, bitch. It's the greatest. To, oh, you made that? Well, he, this guy just dropped three of them over here. You can choose between those. Plus, they're not even that good anymore. So, have at it. They made it so high-ends drop all the time. It's not that exciting. It's like in Diablo when you find a legendary. You're like, ah, way back in the day. But now it's just like, oh, legendary, probably gonna suck, probably gonna deconstruct it. But, what can we start on Diablo? Shit's good. That shit's good. Uh, there's no multiplayer in that, right? No, there's no multiplayer in that. It's just co-op and story. Uh, I can't, I, I, I'll keep going on and on about what good games are. My favorite good games, Destiny. Probably gonna regret saying that eventually. Because Destiny will find some way to fuck me, it always does. But, Destiny is a good game. I will say that now. And Elder Scrolls Online, good game. Um, Skyrim, also a good game. Um, Doom is pretty good. Uh, they've, they've done pretty well in multiplayer. Um, making your own maps, that's pretty sweet. Um, a lot of people are going to talk shit, but Halo has its own backstory. Um, 
they did pretty well in the multiplayer. Um, they, the, the overall look and feel of the game is absolutely great. I did say Dark Souls, I believe. Um, the Borderlands series actually is quite, quite good. The reason I'm not including Call of Duty in this is because Call of Duty is its own different genre of game. It is neither fun nor bullshit. Um, you can be good at the game, or you can suck at the game, but that's, I, there's no, there's no, that's, bang, you're dead. I want to do that again? Bang, you're dead. That's fuck. There's no, I mean, when you're like, when you, when you play for money, fuck it. I'll play, I'll play that game for money. I'm, I'm not, I don't suck at that game. I'm pretty good. I'm not the greatest, but I can, I'll play that shit for money. If you're playing competitive, fuck yeah, that's a good game to play. People play the games because, people, people play games, people, what am I trying to say here? People choose the games they want to play to their, to their liking because if they're, say I, uh, I really like Call of Duty. Say I like that. Really like it. But everybody else keep bashing it. There will be people playing that game. I'm going to keep playing it because I'm good at it. It makes me feel good. Games are all about, all about make you feel good, make you feel powerful and strong, and fucking look at that shit. You think this fucking feels good in real life? <sighs> that does. No. Being this kind of sucks. But what I like is a good MMO. Or close to an MMO. I like those because online friends don't gotta deal with real bullshit. No, no. Um, but I like completing things as a group, whereas in real life I can't go kill a fucking dragon, can I? Nope. It's all about what you you want, what you feel, and I think that people should really not bash games, but like just just think about how it makes. This piece of plastic is fucking bothering me. Just think about what you make fun of before, before, like before you start bashing it. Because games can be good, you just gotta pay attention to what the game consists of. Now, I have no idea where this video was going, but I just wanted to talk to people what my opinion was on a good game. Hashtag Jermeme. Help my cousin out. Nobody's gonna probably watch this video, but fuck it, right? Um, another thing. Uh, this is separate from this video, but um, I am. There's uh, okay. I'm moving. Um, it's gonna take me longer to get to work, and it's gonna take me longer to get home. I'll have less time to do things, so I will be making videos on my day off, and on my days on. But um, I'm going to try and make at least one video a week. I know, this is going to suck. Because um, right now my, uh, my videos are all over the place. I make videos when I have time for them. Um, which today, yeah, I've got a good eight hours. I might, my, I might make a video or two, or I might not. I might research. But um, yes, I'll be moving. And um, my videos are going to be a little different. I'm going to try and vlog every day. We'll see how that goes. Um, I'm going to have different types of vlogs. I used to make, like, I make Facebook videos where people think they're funny, so I'm probably going to do those, throw those on there, and I will be making videos talking about my channel, then I'll make videos talking about probably my dog and how my life at home is going, and then I will have my actual videos, and it will just consist of the game that I am currently into at the moment, because I don't like going out of my way. I know it sucks, but I have <laughs> very, very little time to do things in my life. So, um, I will be, um, doing the games that I, I like at the time, and that are popular, I believe. I like to play popular games. Anyways, I gotta go, because I need some pistachios, and I have to bathroom, and I need to play some Destiny before my wife gets home. So, thank you for watching. If you did, if you just skipped over the video, fuck you. Hashtag Jeremy. It's a picture of my cousin. It says... Says Jermeem down there. I don't know what that's about, but we'll uh, we'll we'll talk about that in another video. Um, also, my website will be going up. Um, I'm gonna get the whole 
you know, email me this, email me that, or tag me. In the, uh, Facebook is the best way to get a hold of me. Look, uh, look up the the only the space only space obliga. It is a Facebook group. People can join it. Um, post pictures, post things, do whatevs, hashtag it. All I do is game. You know, you sitting around with your buddies playing some games or whatever, or you know, funny memes that you find. Like a, I don't know, just just whatever. We're gonna, we're gonna work on that another time. But I'm gonna go now because I've taken too long. So I will see you guys in another video. Flailing my arms. Peace out. Toodaloo. Kangaroos.